welcome back to Grace's room. So guys, that's it. My school holidays have come to an end. I start school tomorrow and I'll be doing my first year of high school and I'll be starting year seven. I'm a little bit nervous, but I'm also really excited. I think I'm all organized for school, but one thing that I have forgotten to do is pack my bag. So here I have all of my books and my stationery, and I did not realize that there was going to be this much stuff. Anyway, I thought that maybe you guys could help me pack all of my stuff and I need to put it all in my bag. So let's start. So here I have all of my textbooks. I have a lot here. This is my maths book, maths textbook, and I didn't realize it was gonna be this thick. Maths is not my favorite subject, so this is going to be interesting. <laughs> here I have my food book for my cooking class. And yeah, I really like cooking, so I'm really excited to do this class. Here I've got my science book. And then here are my language, languages book, <laughs> books. <laughs> here I've got my Italian and Indonesian book because we'll be learning both of these languages this year. And I think next year we'll be able to choose which language we prefer to learn. And I think I'll be doing Italian just because I'm part Italian and also I think my mum would like it if I knew how to speak Italian as well. And lastly, I have my music book for music lessons. I'm not very good at music, so I'll see how that one goes as well. Anyway, I need to label all of these books. So here I've got my labels. And let's start labeling. <laughs> I might use these labels. I remember using these ones last year. Okay, finally done. Now I need to put them all in my school bag. All right, that is all. I have a feeling that I'm going to be breaking my back on the first day of school tomorrow because I'm gonna be carrying so many books. Okay, now here I have all of my notebooks. I've also got a dictionary and some books that I am actually reading that I have to read for school. I'm reading trash at the moment. It's really good. Anyway, there are a lot of books here and I don't think that I need to bring all 20 of these notebooks to school on the first day. And I'm not gonna actually label them because I'm not really sure what I'm gonna be like using them or which subject I'll be using them for. So I'm only gonna be bringing a couple and I'll label them at school when I find out. So I'll just bring just a couple. That seems like enough. And now I'm gonna get my school bag and put them in. There we go. And maybe I might bring one of these maths books. It's like a graph book. And then this one as well. I'm not sure what we're supposed to be using this one for. Maybe for like angles and stuff. I'm not sure. <laughs> And I might put these books in later when I finish going through the rest of this because they're quite small and I don't want to get them squashed. Okay, I'll bring these maybe like th more throughout the weeks, like when I find out which when I'll be needing them or what I'll need them for. So I'll just leave these to the side for now. And now I have all of these things. I'm not sure what I'll be needing any of this for. Here I've got a visual art diary and I'm not sure again what this is for, but I'll bring it anyway. And I think I might just put a little label here. And that can go in my bag. And then I might just bring one of these. I'll put another little label on it. And that can also go in my bag. I might leave this one and I'll bring it maybe later. Here I have a binder and this binder is filled with so many things. 
I might need to put my bag to the side. <laughs> There's so much stuff here and I'm not sure what I'll be needing any of this for. So in here I have a, looks like maybe a music book. Here I have a tracing pad. I've got some dividers, obviously for the binder. I've got a lot of binders, I mean uh, dividers. And then here I've got some little cases. Got the name, whoops. <laughs> and then I have some plastic pockets. Some more books. I'm not sure what this is. <laughs> and then another little case. Okay, now, so confusing, I'm not sure really what to bring. I might leave this binder here because I couldn't imagine what we can really do with it on the first day. I might bring maybe like one of the plastic pockets, but I probably need to label that. And now that can go in my bag. I'll leave these ones here. These are like binder wallets. Probably won't need these if you're not gonna bring the binder. The cases, probably don't need. And then these dividers, I won't need. Hmm. Whatever this is, I'm probably not gonna need. <laughs> this case, I might bring it. In my bag. And I might just bring one of these. And then lastly here I've got a binder buddy. So I think I can just like carry this around and put my binder in it, but since I don't bring the binder, I'm not gonna need this. Okay, now I can put in my dictionary and my books. And I actually forgot to put in my tracing pad and my music book. I'll just quickly put these in as well. And now I think that the back pocket or the back zip of my bag is officially full to the brim. <laughs> okay, now I also got to have some other things here like some stationery. Here I have my art smock, which I'm pretty sure I'll be using this for art and also maybe cooking as well. So I'll bring this. I also put my name on it as already. There we go. I'll put my bag to the side. <laughs> That's not gonna stay up. And here I have a lot of stationery. I also have my lock here and I finally worked out how to unlock it, it took such a long time. See? Here it is. And I'll need this for my locker at school. I've never actually had a locker before, so this is gonna be fun. <laughs> Here I've got my sewing scissors and my dressmaking scissors. They look very fancy. <laughs> I also have some headphones here. I've got two pairs of these and I'm not really sure what we'll be using these for. Hopefully for listening to music. <laughs> but I'll only bring one set of these to school. I'll fix that up later. <laughs> and now I have all of my stationery. So I have a lot in here and I'm probably going to label most of it. Some of this stuff is also for the dressmaking because we'll be doing sewing and I'm really excited for that. What do we have here? I've got some scissors and I've also got some like, maybe some, they're like art line. So probably like fine lines, like maybe for like tracing things or maybe for using to mark things, I'm not sure. <laughs> anyway, I might just write my name just on the middle here. <laughs> Not right, M. Here we go. It's pretty rough, but it's okay. <laughs> oh, 
Okay, and here I've got a chalk wheel, and this is for sewing, I'm pretty sure. I might just put a little label on the outside. And I'll figure out what to do with this, maybe when I get to school. And now here I've got a lot of pencils. And I've also got some pens. And now I need to put a label on all of these, so I will be right back. <laughs> Okay guys, I've finally finished labeling all of these pens and pencils and now I need to put them in. Hang on, I don't have a pencil case. How could I forget to get a pencil ha case? <laughs> all right, I will be right back. I need to go get a pencil case. Dad? Pencil case, pencil case. This one's cute. Hmm. I like this one. Hmm. Oh, I could use this one as well. I might get both. Alright, I've got my stuff, now I need to go home and finish packing. Okay guys, I'm back for a quick trip to the store. I got two pencil cases, one here and then another one. And the reason I got two is because I thought I could put my stationery in one and then I can also put my dressmaking kit and supplies in the other. So this pencil case is really cute, I'm going to put my stationery in this one. There we go. Now this is nice and big actually and it should be able to fit all of my pens and my pencils in. There we go. And now here I've also got my eraser and I might just take it out of the packaging. And that can also go in my pencil case. I've also got my glue stick, which I'm just going to quickly label. There we go. And what else do I have? Oh, I've got my whiteboard markers as well, actually. I might label those too. And they can also go in. And what else? Oh, I've also got my scissors. Are they going to fit? They don't fit. I might have to put them in my other pencil case then. I also have my USB and I might have to cut this one out. There we go. And I'm going to put this in as well. And oh, I've also got my rulers and they're obviously not going to be fitting into my pencil case. But I'll quickly label them now. Okay, there we go. I might put these in my bag later, but now I'm just gonna quickly fill up my dressmaking supplies bag. All right, there we go. This is actually really cool, and I actually, the reason I got one that was like clear is because that way I'll be able to tell like what supplies are inside of there, so I can just quickly reach in and get them out. <laughs> So I've got all of my needles here. And I don't think I need to label these. I have some more needles. I've got some scissors. Oh, I forgot to put these in. <laughs> I have, this is like a little pick that I think you take out stitching with. And I decided that I might take out this little chalk wheel because I won't need the wrapping. It's gonna take up space. can also go in. Oh, I also forgot about my dressmaking scissors. I also have a little case just so they don't stab anyone. <laughs> and, oh, I 
also have my dressmaking pins and look how cute the colors are. I'm like in love with these. And I think that's pretty much all. Oh yeah, I also have my calculator here and that's not gonna be fitting in any of the pencil cases. There we go. And now I can put this all in my bag. I also have a big mess here. Now I'm ready. <laughs> Let's just move all this rubbish out of the way so it doesn't get in my way. Now let's get the bag. Oh. Uh. Calculator. My rulers. I have to go on this one. My pencil case, my other pencil case, and oh, I nearly forgot my lock. <laughs> I think that's all. Wow. Well, guys, I'm ready for school now. Now I'm ready. Okay guys, so I hope you enjoyed this back to school video. Wish me luck, firstly carrying this bag to school and also for my first day. Um, I will see you next time on Grace's Room. Bye for now. All right, let's get this out.